basically, I like every idea to make it possible to start the fire just with the Swiss Army knife. But, as I saw, this tiny micro fire steel the first time, I was not sure if this is just a lower price gimmick or if this is worth the money. I would say, let's test it before we judge. No joke, my friends. This Victorinox Huntsman is my very first knife I own. I got it 40 years ago from my godmother. And this is probably the most useful gift I received in my whole life. I was already a thousand times happy that I carried this knife with me. So weeks ago, Victorinox launched this fire kit. It contains a micro fire steel and a tinder coil. The cool thing is to store it, you can turn it into the corkscrew like the screwdriver you already know. This additional feature makes my super useful Huntsman even more versatile than it already was before because now I can start the fire in almost every weather condition. This fire end will never be my primary fire source. For that, it is too expensive and too small. But in an emergency situation, if you don't have a, a, another possibility, it's priceless. If you have a small, hidden, reliable fire source in your pocket knife. In this video, I want to find out if only the Helix Tinder works together with this micro fire steel or if you can also use other tinder materials in case the helix tinder is used up. And I want to find out how many initial flames can I produce with this micro fire steel until it breaks. The first thing I want to try out is to ignite the helix tinder. For that I take about a quarter or a third of this tinder Then it's super important that you fluff it up like this. Take the wood saw, hold it, take the microfiber steel, support it with the index finger, and now. It burns. This is super easy and I saw in other videos that this works also if the, if the tinder coil is totally wet. As you could see, it's the Helix tinder. It works super easy. Now I want to try out if it works also with other tinder material. I want to try out fibers from a natural cordage. I'm going to try out if it works with a tissue. I want to try out if it works with a tampon. I want to try out if it works with fat wood. And I want to try out if it works with birch bark. I start with the natural cord. So let's take a piece of this hemp fiber cord and twist it up Super. Next tinder I want to try out is tampon. So I open the plastic cover, take out a little bit of the cotton wool. Also this works perfect 
So the next hint I want to try out is a tissue. And for that I need just one layer. Now I fluff it up. Almost, yes. So, okay, I would say the tissue is not that easy as the hemp fibers and the, the cotton wool from the tampon, but it works also. I would say we change to the next hinder. That's it, that is. Uh, fat wood. Yes. So fat wood works also, but not as good as tissue, cord fibers and uh, cotton wool from a tampon. The next thing I want to try out is birch bark. This is just the paper thin upper layer from birch. So I took it away like this and uh, Actually, this should work perfect. Ah, I have problems to ignite it with this uh, micro fire steel. So let's try out with a big fire steel. Okay, so in my opinion, Birch Park is not really the best tinder for this microfiber steel. Maybe because it's not fine enough. But uh, if you have another experience, please let me know in the in the comments. Okay, next thing is I want to try out how many initial fires can I produce with this little fire steel and I want to try out with the different tinders who works the best I want to try out with cotton wool with uh, cord fibers and with tissues let's start that well because this is not that fine as, uh, as these fibers and, and cotton wool so that's why I decided that uh, we go on with cotton wool and hemp fiber.
hem fibers uh, are finished, uh, we go on with the cotton wool. Yes, my friends, handled initial fires with this micro fire steel. And after handled fires, it looks like this. So, my friends, now to my conclusion. First of all, I have to say I'm positively surprised about the performance of this micro fire steel. As I read the user manual, I couldn't believe that it is possible to make hand of fires with this micro fire steel. Of course, it depends very much which tinder you use. As fine the tinder, as better it works. But with these helix tinders, with tampon or with uh, hemp fiber, yes, it's possible to make 100 initial fire. That's why I would say this is more than just a toy. If you don't need this as primary fire source, if you need this just in an in a emergency situation, if you don't have another fire source, this gives you a backup for many, many, many years. I like it. So my friends, that's it for today. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and see you next Friday. Ciao!